over a step burpee today. So this is what it looks like. So when we break that down, benefits, full body integration, high metabolic demand. We are simply gonna start by taking a nice big reach towards the ceiling so that we have length through the front of the body. From here, hinging forward from the hip. If you need to bend the knees, that's fine. Plant the hands on the ground, step back, step back. And now as we step forward, bring the foot outside of the hand and we're gonna stand nice and tall at the top every single time. Um, we have a couple different progression and regression strategies that we can use in this exercise. So if we wanna make it a little bit more challenging, the first thing we can do is turn it just into a regular burpee. So from here, come on down, jump out, jump in, and stand up at the top. If you wanna take it one step further than that, as we come down, jump in, and we jump up, hands up, every single time. So there's three different options in order to just adjust your workout for whatever fitness level that you're at today. Now, some of the common faults that we see with this burpee is as we come down, walking it out, people tend to bring it in and bring their feet really narrow, and that causes excessive lumbar flexion and puts a lot of additional stress on our lower back. So what we wanna do instead is take the legs and step in outside of the hands. Because in this position, we're actually lifting through the chest, tightening through the core, and we're actually helping to protect the back. Good deal? So that is your step burpee. Uh, pick the option that feels right for you.